Hello and welcome to Sean White's Solar and Energy Storage Podcast. In this podcast, we're going to talk about should climate change conferences get into things that are really important, such as human rights, or should they just stick with the molecules? You know, the carbon with two oxygens thing, CO2. So I was at the COP27 conference in Egypt in November, and I took a bunch of notes, and I already did one podcast on it. And one of the things that I noticed is there was a whole lot going on about human rights, sexual rights, economic injustice. And I'm wondering if that is going to slow down fighting climate change, because one of the things that you find out is there are a bunch of jerks in this world who hate anything to do with human rights. And are they going to turn on the planet and go against climate change because we put them in the same sentence? I don't have the answer for this, but I just thought I would pose the question. One of the things that bothers me is I see that there are a lot of people that are on the same team that are fighting each other. You get two people or two different groups that dedicate most of their lives to fighting climate change. And then one of those groups is doing what they call canceling the other group because they don't like it that they have a sense of humor. And I think that we all need to be on the same side. And I don't want to take away from anything such as human rights. You know, there's a lot of real important subjects there, such as not buying solar equipment that's made by forced labor. And then also just recently I saw on the news, I was really surprised. It seemed like, am I reading this correctly? That Greta, you know, the famous climate change activist girl over there from Sweden, who's awesome, was actually protesting against a wind farm. And I was like, what? But apparently the wind farm was on some indigenous land. And I don't know the details. I'm not taking sides on this or anything. But I just thought that was very strange and interesting. But I do think that it's very urgent that we get this climate change thing taken care of. Because if things go really south, or I should say the south heats up really bad, ice melts, sea level rises, all that kind of stuff, then that's going to violate everybody's human rights, especially a lot of indigenous people. And there's no perfect answer to these solutions, but I think it's very important that we all work on the same team instead of fighting amongst ourselves. There are a lot of people that are not on our team. And when they see people that are fighting against climate change, fighting against each other, they celebrate. And anybody that's against humor has got a problem. And I think that there are a lot of ways that we can take a really good joke about a really sensitive subject and get people to actually change their minds better than any other way. Because when people can laugh at their own stupidity, that's how people change. And that's why when I teach my classes, I like to make people laugh. (laughs) That probably really sounds like a crazy person. So I want to just end this with a quote from Rodney King. Can't we all just get along? People, I um, I just, I just want to say, you know, can we, can we all get along? Can we, can we get along? Please, we can, we can get along here. We we all can get along. We, let's try to work it out. Let's try to beat it, you know. Let's try and work it out. Thank you. So thanks for listening to Sean White's Solar and Energy Storage Podcast. To find out more about solar, storage, certifications, training, and everything else under the sun, go to solar, S-E-A-N, that's solarshawn.com.